Greetings, greetings. Like I wanted to capture um, some of the some of the settings and uh, temperatures and just overall specs. I, I'm still trying to get my head wrapped around the the voltage requirement plus the temperature. Um, I don't know if I'm a little hypersensitive to um, I think the amount of cooling that I got in this system is impressive. I, I probably got two hundred dollars worth of cooling between liquid cooling and um, you know fans and whatnot. So to the the only part that's a little warm is the front where the the radiator sits. But right now it's sitting at fifty one at, at pretty much idle. I do have OBS running and I'm recording, but it's I'm not running any three D. So I'm gonna fire up um, Cinebench and we're gonna get a Cinebench score. And I probably could get a little higher out of it, but I have the uh, was a Gigabyte Azeroth. Uh, I think it's called the Elite. I need to record some of that footage with my phone. I haven't f figured out how to properly record that, those kinds of settings when you don't have the computer to record those kinds of settings. So I guess the, ultimately the answer is, is I record it with my phone and then upload it into uh, my video editing software as a solution. But you, here you can see the course fire off. I don't know why this is saying 4850. Uh, everything, everything is pretty much stock. Um, it won't even let me adjust that. But it, it's the the processor is supposed to be 3800, so I don't know I don't know where this is coming from, um, you know. And here you can see. Let me pull this up real quick. Here you can see the uh, the rest of my RAM settings. I don't have the best RAM. I I thought I I got a better, but it's like it's like uh, Hilux or Hynex. I don't remember. But it's not the nice Samsung B modules. And I I had dialed this memory in. To its uh, to its settings and uh, but I had to do a a, a motherboard uh, systems config reboot just to to because I was messing with the, the the voltage on this trying to get the voltage uh, and it's it looks more respectable now than what it did the other day because the other day this was running at 1.47 1.46 I was like that's just too much voltage but uh, I noticed as as I let it run for a while, it'll it'll the voltage will kind of um, seem to pull down. But if I just do a fresh restart, the voltage will be pushing uh, really high. So let me run let me run Cinebench just to see. And this is uh, just for kind of uh, some situational awareness. Uh, this is a uh, Ryzen 9 3900X 12 core processor, and then I have the Radeon 7 graphics card in it. Um, you know, it looks like it's VRAM is set to one to one. It's at 1600 memory clocks. I did go into the motherboard uh, based off Jimmy's video and put in the uh, what do they call it, Infinity Fabric. I dialed that in. I seemed to make things a little bit more responsive. But I'm just gonna run this and let's see what it does. Now, some of the other applications that I noticed we see all the processors 38 so this this is okay I mean it's maybe it's a little low um, but look at the temps the temps 95 degrees with all these I feel like that's just too high it's just pegged out at 95 degrees and so basically it throttled is what it did it hit 95 and then they all throttled at 3957 um, and it's not an issue of – I don't feel like it's the, the overall performance is, is an issue. It's just the temp, what I'm worried about. Um, but let's see what it comes in. I'm sure if I dialed in the memory a little better, um, you know, maybe I need to replace the thermal paste. I'm not, I'm not sure what the, the exact deal is. But look, I, I got a score. That's actually a little lower than, um, than what it was the other day. The other day it was the 39. Um, you know, and he pulls back down. But 6,500. I was. I've watched a few of the other YouTubers um, pull pull Cinebench scores of uh, 7,100. So uh, there's probably a little bit more um, configuration overhead that needs to take place. Uh, and OBS could could be pulling off some of it. I don't know how much uh, OBS is drawing from from the specs, but I'll. Um, I'm going to run it one more time. We're going to look at the voltage. I didn't look at the voltage. Okay, so we're going to run it. See, it says my, my best score is the 65, or that's what I got was the 6557. But up here the other day, I got the 6901. Um, 
so let's let's run this again. We wish you know this is comparable to a thread ripper. I mean, this is definitely on the up upper echelon. Um, what's crazy is it got a seventeen hundreds, a thirty. Um, you know, you get down into the i five, the thirty five hundred, i seven, fifty eight hundred, or fifteen hundreds on the ratio, and then you, we're up to the we're up to the seven thousand. So I'm gonna run this one more time. And pull this back up here so we could see. Now, I want to keep my eye on the voltage um, and see where the voltage gets to. But I feel like the temp's just too high on this on this test. The way that it packs up, and then the volt the voltage is actually much lower. I, I you know it's all over the place. I don't know what what uh, how to change it or what to. Um, how to get it to where it's it's uh, you know cruising along at a nice one point three seven five or one one point three five or um, you know, but it looks like it's maxing out at the thirty nine fifty, and I know it's it's bottlenecking because of the temperature. So I'm not I'm not I feel like something's not right. Something's not right. But anyways, maybe uh, I'm gonna share this video with a couple of folks and maybe there's there there we go one point four. Um, where did I get? I got the 1.577 again, and OBS could play play a piece into it, but um, yeah, I don't know. Um, definitely uh, kind of looking for some feedback here. Uh, thanks for watching. Reading dialed in um, just a little too high, and I did a Cinebench on this thing.